maybe get through Shattuck and make it to Spargo, who he has a very, very detailed history with. We'll cover that if we get there, but let's start with this first one on Hollow Bastion. It's Osimo, it's Sonics, it's game number one of loser semis. Let's get it. That was some uh, nice uh, camera work right there, bro. I saw that. The, the, yeah, a little countdown over there, the Pikachu car right before it go. But yeah, we're going to go straight here, uh, go straight into this match. And honestly, we look like we're going straight at Sonic. 66% already on oh, yeah. uh, Sonic as far as damage goes. I think Osmo might have put himself in a spot where he wasn't able to fully uh, capitalize on that advantage, but doesn't matter. I'm right back into it. You, you may have gave up a little bit of your stage control, but you got it right back, and it looks like you're about to be threatening the stock real soon. Yeah, Osimo, the sole representative for Japan in this top four. Absolutely, maybe trying to avenge his brethren. You know, Akola, you know, Mia both fell to Sonics, but the way Osimo is starting things out, looks like he is not trying to be on that trajectory. Excellent first stock, and now working on some more damage. Uh oh. Yeah, I mean, more damage. I mean, we got to work on any type of damage here from Sonics, bro. Bro, it's only got 36% percent, bro. Like, can I get a crumb of damage on the screen right now on Osmo? It ain't looking too good for Sonics on his first, uh, you know, first outing, at least his first stock against Osmo. But he is able, you know, one thing he's able to do, clearly slow the game down to a crawl if he really needs to. Yeah, for sure, for sure. It's been something I've seen actually a lot of the, I've been calling like the, the Japanese slowdown, really. I mean, it was a, uh, uh, not shoot tone, uh, Aqua. Yeah. He played them first two games against Mars. Or he uh, played them the last two games against Mars. And he's like, got beat up. And he's like, man, I'm about to slow this down to a crawl. That's it, bro. And let me tell you, did it work? It worked. <laughs> so like, that's just something everybody could have. Sometimes you just got to slow the game down, kind of frustrate your opponent. They're like, how come you not fighting me? I don't always have to fight. That's big facts, man. I got it. You know, you always got to mix it up, right? Keep your opponent guessing. Does not need to be the same game every time for Sonic, though. Looking a little familiar right now. He is definitely electing to keep some space between these two, chipping away at this lead of Osimo. And he can do it with plenty of time on this clock. 137. Back, you're not going to connect. Able to focus through that. However, the pressure right now from Sonics mm. starting to really mount mm. big time. And there it is off the top. And just like that, a rather what I thought was a large lead whittled down to just a couple of percent. Yeah, I mean, it has been, it's, it is, I don't really know how you're supposed to like. <laughs> Um, approach Sonic as my man Ryu. Like, you really have to do this chase down the way he's doing it right now. But, yeah, if, you, if he decides to try to stay back and just play the fireball game, it's very yeah. easy for Sonic to just kind of jump through over and now try to put a little pressure on himself. Ooh. Now, if Osmo can stay this close as often as he is right now, this does become a way scarier right. game. And just put the leg out, the soft F tilt into the back air, stanky leg. Some of the best conversions I've ever seen out of Osmo came in his loser's quarter set against Hurt, man. This guy is definitely unleashed. Mm. Conquered one of those bracket demons in Yoshidora who typically has his number. Showing up big time to the Supernova stage. Can he do it one more time against Sonics? He's got the lead right now. Can be a pretty tough matchup for Asimo. Finding a way to make it work mm. as Sonic searching for answers, searching for hits. Trying to get back in it. Oh, okay. They actually stopped the uh, spin dash here. Yeah, the fireballs haven't really been doing uh, a crazy amount for him, like in neutral. Oh! They oh! Speaking of, okay. that's going to do a lot for you right there. A little spring ride, a little spring combo, actually. Up air, uh, spring up air is going to get him off of that stock. Good stuff to Sonics, making sure this game doesn't get too far away. Yeah. But I was going to say, yeah, no, Osimo's, um, like, fireballs in neutral haven't been doing much for him. As far as, like, in his combos, they've definitely added him. So, oh, wait. No. No, Sonics. Why, brother? What happened, brother? Uh, you know, I used to get surprised, but... At this point, I always just at least expect one. <laughs> yeah. I just expect one at this point. You know what I mean? Like, there's nothing to really, there's nothing negative to say. It's just part of his repertoire. Now, it's something I think he should take out of his repertoire. But the fact that it's part of the repertoire, it's just gonna happen. Yeah, I feel like, gonna like to, I would like to see it maybe on the second stock you know instead saying? of the like, third stock. You know, maybe even the first stock if you're feeling a little, you know, a little froggy. Maybe, but <laughs> maybe lock up game one first. You know, yeah. you, know, <laughs> I, I, you know, I'm just saying. I'm saying. You know, what I'm saying. But it is what it is, right there. Leg sweep not necessary because the recovery not going to get there. Pain on his face. A lot of cheers in the crowd. Y'all rude as hell. But <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. The SD is like, rude as hell. yeah, that's crazy, bro. <laughs> but nonetheless, Osimo <laughs> will wrap up that first game. Let's get it. Crazy work out here. I saw a buddy in the chat. So I just saw him just the, as soon as I looked down, I just saw, yeah, buddy. <laughs> that's like, hey, are you real, bro? <laughs> Insanity. All right, big thinking, big thinking hours out here. So Sonic's, I mean, you know, 
Neither one of these guys, this is going to be the match you're going to see throughout the entirety of this um, this set. I don't yeah. feel like there's any secondaries to be done. Maybe a, a cheeky Osimo can. I'm sure he probably got one there. Everybody, all the Ryu's and Ken's, I feel like have an interchangeable uh, Ryu or Ken. They know a little something, something about the other character. But we all know Osimo for the Ryu. We all know Sonic's for the Sonic. Yeah, we have dedicated with this character. Man, come a long way to having his, his winner's run ended earlier on by tweaking a reverse 3-0. So... He really had to do some climbing to get to this point in bracket, man. So absolutely not trying to let it go to waste. Sonic's known to be a huge and tremendous road bump at any point in the bracket. So many second places to his name. Trying to correct that. A lot of cross stage neutral being played, but I think that's, you know, that's one Sonic's probably trying to bait out a uh, Hadouken, see if he can try to get in there just like that and punish it as fast uh, as possible. And he was able to do such, but it was a small punish, and somehow he ends up being on the receiving side. Dude, I am just super impressed with Osimo, bro. It's not even like the best. The fact that Sonics is elected to be the aggressor, and Osimo just putting up such oh. good defense. Oh. All these counter hits are really paying off. Gonna be a big time focus right there. Not gonna pay off though. Still with the lead, and not afraid to get his hands dirty right now. Right. Big chilling here on the left side and getting himself a fireball uh, for troubles, but. This, now, this is where it definitely gets a little scary sometimes, trying to get, get this recovery. Oh, Ooh. almost thought he went too far away to the, uh, from the ledge to actually get that reverse grab. But no, he does make it back. 100 to 66% now. He's going to add up a little bit here for Sonic. Hold up, Wait. Man. Okay, oh. we saw it before. Yeah, that was terrifying. So close. Nice, Ooh. I like that. Just faking him out a little bit with the movement off of the focus. Great stuff from Osimo. Really locked in and engaged right now. But here comes Sonic's off-stage shenanigans. We got him, no, riding that ledge all the way back to the stage. All right, so awesome. Also try to get tricky in there. One of the, uh, the awesome bears are definitely starting to, uh, to fly. Let me tell you, he be, he be hitting them bears the same way you think about the Spargo bears, but them Come joints be up. accurate. I'll put it out there sometimes. So close in percent, two minutes off the clock right now. Who is going to strike first and get this big time stock? It's going to be Sonics answering the call. Not letting that rocky start deter him from getting that first stock. Let's see if he can push it a little bit further. Just a tippy toe right there on that uh, on that up air too. He was almost out of range, but Noah was able to find it. Good stuff to uh, two uh, Sonics. And yep. now Asimo has to really kind of run down and find himself. One of these, I was, couldn't even finish the sentence. <laughs> One of these bears is what I was about to say. And he said, don't even worry about it. I'm going to deliver it. Prime delivery. What's That's up? Fine. My same day. He said, don't, <laughs> don't worry about finishing sentences, man. We're finishing stocks out here. That's mm -hmm. the Asimo mentality and it has served him very well throughout this tournament now bringing the fight yet again at two sonics like to put some distance between them mm -hmm. okay trying to get comes to the up airs if he can get one of these up airs you know he's always able to string two or three more oh yeah oh, oh i like that okay the wind up oh, and no. the pitch but the tatsu actually working out in osimo's favor all right yeah held it just a little too long i like the idea though it does will we'll potentially hit under the, uh, the edge. And for some reason, if it does hit, he's always able to cancel into a uh, Hadouken, too, if he wants to try to maybe catch uh, a little extra damage in or force him to go low. Oh. All right. He was looking for it. A lot of hard reads have come out through Osimo throughout this bracket. Sonic, don't be on the receiving end. Pressure being applied right now. Love the fact that Osimo is so fearless. And that's how you got to approach this matchup. Can't oh. let Sonic really good at exploiting those recoveries that sometimes can be a little bit telegraphed when dealing with somebody as formidable as Sonic. And now with the lead, what are we going to do with it? Take your time right there. A little over two minutes to go in this one. You know Sonic's man, sometimes when it's time, he will slow it down to a crawl. Not because he has to. Sometimes I feel like it's just done to exert some mental pressure mm -hmm. to your opponent as well, right? Like, what are you actually going to do about this? And sometimes the situation, a whole lot of nothing. Yeah, bro. It's feeling, it's looking, it's definitely a uh, a lot of hold on enough for being developed right now for the for the like the mid half. But we're starting to get some hits here. Yeah. Unfortunately though for Osmo, yeah, it, it's because of the fact that we've slowed this down to a crawl. I haven't really seen too much damage either delivered from him at all. While he is already at 91 on his last stock, 114 on uh, to Sonic's. Like he could find a short you somewhere in here. Another back air too. But then you have a whole other stock to work on. Yeah, this is one of those games where it's just oh. like, it almost feels like it, it's so far out of reach. Osimo has just been doing uh, such impossible feats all throughout. However, will not be the case for game two. The head nod from Sonic's letting you know this is what happens when I don't SD.
Hey, he did. He did end it with a two stock. I'm just saying, I'm bro. Just saying, bro. Like, I got my stocks out here. It's a he even had room too, SD. Like, <laughs> if he really felt like he wanted to do it, a little stock cancel right there. But yeah, no, I was uh. Yeah, kind of perfectly executed, kind of what I expect to see from Sonis. If he's getting, like, scrapped up a little too much, he will, you know, kind of slow it down, hit the hit the left right on you real quick, the uh, the infinite, yes. infinity sign, uh, Sonic gameplay. But when he does get that hit, he's able to capitalize or maximize what he gets off of that hit every time. As you can see, he got a neutral air there. He got an up air a little earlier. Unfortunately, though, for Asimo, that means he's going to have to find a way to stay on top of Sonic the entire time with his character is not really that fast on the ground. You know? Yeah, I mean, that's why really for Asimo, he understands, like, just being able to at least get out to a somewhat of a lead or keep it super close early on. Very, very important, man. You don't want to be sitting there at 130. Sonic's is spinning around at, at 16 on those first stocks, man. That does not tend to air well in situations like this. Knows some other deficiencies of his character in this matchup, but obviously not letting it deter him because it is knotted up one apiece. Heading into game number three, Asimo. Again, trying to keep Japan alive in this bracket. The only remaining member trying to get this W. Let's go. Game number three. We're taking it to Battlefield, the OG Classic. Now, yeah, the Battlefield this is going to give uh, Sonic Sonic even more places to land. But for the most part, yeah, both of these guys actually do get some kind of longer combos depending on uh, how they started up. Like, we're going to get multiple up airs because of the three-platform uh, setup, too, from both sides. Like, you, you definitely get the up air to up air. Uh, from Ryu as well as Sonic. But as of right now, the real answer or the real uh, question that Osmo has to answer is how do I get damage onto Sonic when he is deciding to hit me with the left right gameplay? Man, that's a question that many opponents have failed to answer. That's why he is actually oh. in this situation. I know it looked pretty, but it ain't going to be another KO. Not at that percent, but I like the pressure. I like the damage strings. We are definitely putting it on him right now. 89%. Huge deal right now for Osmo, and he knows it. Mm, kind of forced that opening. Yep. He didn't. He didn't pull the trigger on that. Uh, on that sure you. Sure. Normally, what you see off of the first hit up up air, but maybe he just didn't see the damage uh, there yet, so he didn't want to waste it. Want to keep that sure you fresh. Yeah. Battlefield is a very generous stage as, as far as proportions go. So, gotta make sure if you're gonna go for it, it's gonna get that KO you are searching for, which looks like Asimo on the hunt for it right now. But Sonic's being as elusive as ever and picking his spots. And man, does he pick them well. And the battlefield actually, you know, being a savior right there for uh, Osmo. You know, he saw him actually lose. Oh, 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 no. Oh, I thought the footwork was there. Definitely tried to hit him with an old shimmy, bro. <laughs> a little rope <laughs> dope on that, <laughs> on that platform. Like, okay, buddy. Almost had him. Not quite there. Spring in or something. Oh. oh, wow. Off the whiff grab, Osmo striking as fast as a Viper to take that first stock. Yeah, no, Sonic's just a little too late there, but very good awareness from, from Osmo to realize that, yeah, Sonic's a little too late to uh, try to get what he wants. And so we got some Osmo uh, chance out here, too. Again, this is 1-1 situation in uh, this set, so no one's taking the set just yet, but they are going to put themselves one game closer, taking this flex game. 147 right now on the Osmo. Oh, nice. He's going to live that from the other side of the screen, luckily. Oh, okay. He just goes right into Sonic's, too, man. I mean, at that point, it's like, what do you have to lose? Back throw. No, nah, that, that grab was clean. Yeah, it was. That, grab, that was one of them situations where, like, normally Sonic's does that reverse. You expect him to try to drop the back air on you. Empty land into the into the back throw was good. Low key. Okay. All right. Big match. Still developing. Game number three. Oh. oh. All right. The dare not quite there, but I like the fear that Asimo continues to put into Sonic's. No hesitation, man. All gas, no brakes on his side. A lot of brakes on Sonic's side. Okay. okay. He said, he said, my, bro, my, man, he said my man's brakes are new. Okay. <laughs> Michelin, man. Yeah, break. Michelin, man. <laughs> on it real quick. With all kinds of sponsors out here, chat. Oh, stringing him up. Got two on there. Top platform offering a little bit of sanctuary, though, to break it up. Uh oh. Yeah, this, game, this lead that uh, that was uh, developed here from Oscar was slowly starting to get cut into. Yep. And, yeah, I mean, only I mean a little less than 15% between them. Does finally get himself a uh, forward air. Some more damage here on to the screen. Oh. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. That could have been tremendous in the spring just to keep Ashimo off balance a little bit. Stock remains intact. 132 for Sonics. Scary territory if you try to approach. And I wonder if that was a missed input. He was trying to maybe do like a reverse uh, short you or if he actually just wanted that uh. top suit hit. Like, both of them are good sure. ideas. And I, I just, in that situation, I was expecting more the dash check, more of a, uh, of a sure you than uh, the top two there. However, wasn't expecting that dash check to hit like that either. And he almost got the stock. 
that he did. Ashimo almost essentially rewriting the book on how to approach this match right in front of us. Doing a sensational job. But Sonic's still not letting that second stock go. And he has actually brought Ashimo into kill range as well. But it's not going to matter. Just the rawest of back airs to close out that stock. Uh -oh. Can we push it a little bit further, though, with this lead, TK? Got to find out. He has not really been able to hold leads too much. And you can see Sonics, you know, he's willing to just kind of run away from it. He kind of has to, though. Yeah. You don't want to get caught on these platforms, getting hit with some of these uh, up airs, because the damage can rack up very quickly. You're getting hit with repeated up airs. Man. Hey, Neutral Air has been doing a very good job of thwarting the up. Oh! Can't do it. It's two Insane. hits. It's two hits. And I kind of like the idea Osmo did, even though it is two hits. So, you know, that move can be unreliable at times. Ooh. So he might have been able to get through that second hit regardless. It's getting spooky oh. out here. It's uh -oh. getting spooky. Scary hours for sure. Wait a minute. Don't let it be you, Osmo. About to hit that two minute marker. Some of that time where Sonics absolutely thrives and pulls ahead even further. He's looking good. He's got this lead right now. TK final stocks mm. on just under that two-minute mark. Does he have enough to pull this one back? You know, Sonic ain't gonna make it easy for him. Not at all. 147 left on the clock too. So you know you got to start looking up at that uh, that timer. You might actually have to just hope that you're able to end the game with something crazy. 50% only, 30% differential, 34% uh, differential yep. between them. But Sonics, so it don't matter difference. Do I have the lead? <laughs> You know, you know the vibes. You know the vibes, man. LG getting that tweet ready already. I know it. <laughs> I feel, he actually almost caught him at the top right there. He did catch him jumping in, but somehow that was not on mark. 125 now to the 60. Ooh. Yeah, it, it's really up to Osmo to just get down, get some damage, and now get a stock because you want me winning this off time. Yeah, those landing routes really being covered extremely oh. well by Sonics. But hold on now. One opening trying to present itself for Osmo. Excellent grab. Had him caught up in that shield. Definitely thinking defensive options right now, considering that percentage in the spring is going to end it. Game number three going the way of Sonics. Crazy. Yeah, that was a, uh, what a turnaround right there, too. As I said, when is time for yeah. Sonics to kind of, we were talking about the breaks, bro. Freshly installed, because he can definitely <laughs> slow <slump> down. <laughs> Quick with it, but. Either way, you know, when he when he does slow it down, he slows it down, gets uh, that finally starts getting those openings, and he starts capitalizing on that. So can't be mad at the uh, the success yeah. of that plan, as it seems to be working uh, quite often for him. Yeah. That was clean, man. Definitely seemed like could have been some opportunities for Osmo to get in there, but Sonic's just let like, his defense be so secure, and that right there I thought was absolutely huge. Getting that grab because he recognized Osmo's just thinking defense, defense, defense. I'm at 164. And in the pain look on his face when the spring takes the stop with no tech in sight. It can be a it can be a lot, man, but you gotta have a short memory out here. 2-1 lead for Sonics, looking to book his trip to losers finals one more time. Can he get the job done? Asimo, we need a response from you, and we need it right now, my boy. We're going back to Battlefield for game number four. Let's go. Asimo say he's definitely feeling the stage. Oh, he is. As I said, man, it has been given a lot a lot of space for like Sonics to land, do things like this. And now he's even got a top platform uh, in the mix. And sometimes if he ends up finding you up there as you're trying to land, it has a better chance uh -oh. of getting that uh, up air spring up air. Uh -oh. Yo, bro can't even play the game though. We're talking about what could happen uh -oh. on the stage. Let's talk about what's happening off the stage. Only destruction, my man couldn't get anything done. Only the pity sure you, <laughs> <laughs> the pity sure you to get some damage on before he loses that stock. Oh man, so I ain't gonna send you home empty handed, bro. Go ahead and take this little bit of something. something. <laughs> Take a little bit of something, something, get it through customs, you'll be all right. But right now, domination on the part of Sonics. This Hedgehog absolutely unleashed in this game number four. Taking the crowd out of it a little bit, man. A lot of people may be starting to see the writing on the wall, but Osimo continuing to fight. I just, man, I, 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 I me? Yeah. I'm defeated already, bro. Right, 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 uh, right. But that's why he's a top player and I'm over here, bro. Because right, right, right. <laughs> it's, it's, it's my tournament game. Right now, potentially. I mean, and I just went out with an almost, almost zero death. Mm -mm. I mean, it's tough, man. You don't shy away from competition. That's not what we do around here. Make top four a supernova. You want to make it count. But Sonics, obviously, with the same mindset and just completely ping ponging Asimo into the blast zone. My goodness. He had that thing perfected like it was an Olympic sport. Give him the gold medal right to hell now. Man. 
in one of them situations. Well, actually, where, no, like, no, Sonics would be track and field, let's be honest. Yeah, this is one of them situations right now. I feel yeah, like right. if Osmo get off the stage and just light up a cigarette, I'll get it. <laughs> 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 like, I'll understand, bro. I'm like, you know what, man? Uh, Rough outing, bro. I'll see you in space, cowboy. Mm. <laughs> get it. But here we are, one stock. Deficit is facing Asuma on his tournament life right now. A lot of things going the way of Sonics as they continue to this string of aerials led by the opening of that up air, giving him such a tremendous lead. Oh man. It ain't nothing pretty, bro. Mm -hmm. It ain't nothing pretty. Man, and it's not getting any prettier either, bro. No amount of BBLs gonna say this game, bro. No Drizzy. Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Ooh. All right, trying to wait out the focus. No, not quite yet. Still a little bit of signs of life from Osimo. Gasping for a chance at this game. 129 on that final stock. The door is seemingly closing. But Osimo trying to break it the hell down. Getting the crowd back in in a little bit. A glimmer of hope for Japan's last representative against this Dominican menace in Sonics. This is the craziest part of this. This is actually like a, a, a premium hold moment. This oh, yeah. is Ryu with race. Oh, yeah, facts. So, like, him getting two interactions that lead to like good combos and to a third interaction that leads to a Shoryu. That's not going to be the interaction right. you need to start it off, but at least we're getting something on the board. Hold, chat. Hold. Uh oh. Can't hold, hold for long hold. enough, though. But can you hold on? The answer is no. Sonics with the 3 1 victory over Asimo. And with that, NA has claimed the top three spots at Supernova. There it is. Avengers Assemble. <coughs> Was that Kels? <laughs> that had to be Kels in the background. Oh, I know, that had to be Kels. A Sonic, no, yeah, there it is, look at her. <laughs> She's a real one, bro. That's a fan. She a fan, she a fan, she a fan. There it is. What the hell? Oh, right now? Damn, all right. Yeah. <laughs> no medal ceremony? That's crazy, bro. He really is about to step outside and take that, <laughs> that drag, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. I flew all the way for this. I get it, bro. I get it. I mean, I get I get. we got to introduce the next players, but can we let the other guy get off the stage first? I'm saying, I mean, bro. damn, bro. <laughs> Handing him his medal, introducing the next guy. He got his bags packed too. The hell are we doing over here? Like a fast food restaurant, bro. Oh, Here's man. your food. Have a nice day, bro. Here's your medal. I, mean, I know we changed the name. <laughs> we changed the runner show too. Good lord. Oh man. Anyway, good stuff. Good stuff all. It's all fun games. All fun. It is. Game. It is. It's all love here. It's we, all we, love. We're gonna keep it going. That was our lose. Same means I mean, Sonics is gonna be stepping back up now to play a classic. I mean, it's gonna be classics right now for the rest of this here tournament. Oh, definitely. Sonics. Shadow, uh, Shattuck and uh, Spargo, all in whatever combination they play, another classic match.